Hello and welcome to the Golf Digest Middle East preview of the Abu Dhabi HSBC Golf Championship, the first major European Tour event of the 2016 season. We're down at Abu Dhabi Golf Club behind us, a packed driving range full of the stars of the global game. I'm delighted to be joined by a couple of stars of their own. Danny Jakubowski, the Director of Instruction here at Abu Dhabi Golf Club, and Callum Nickel, the Director of Golf. Guys, great to have you with us. Great to get your insight on the championship. It's a huge one because world number one, Jordan Spieth, is making his debut this week in Abu Dhabi. Already that budding rivalry, Danny, between Jordan and Rory, both coming off big wins. Jordan in Hawaii getting to 31 under par, which is just crazy scoring. Ooh. And Rory, his own impressive win in Dubai uh, back at the end of November for the race to Dubai. Mm. How do you see that rivalry developing here this week in Abu Dhabi? You know, this is what the golf world's been waiting for. Um, I mean, and, and it's here. Uh, it, it, there's going to be fireworks, and, and I think the biggest thing is contrasting the two different styles of play. Uh, it's going to be great to watch, Robbie, really, really. OK, well, Callum, other stars as well, not just Rory and, and Jordan, but Ricky Fowler, yeah. obviously the colourful American. He's here. He, he made his debut last year at Abu Dhabi Golf Club. What do you expect from Ricky this week? It's a course that should suit him. Yeah, I know Ricky enjoys the course. Um, he's been here for a few days preparing already on the back of some really good seasons for him as well. So, you know, he's, uh, he's going to be in contention for sure. We've also got Henrik Stenson here, a former runner-up at this championship, a three-time winner in Martin Keimer. Who can forget last year, Danny, the, the drama on the final day with Keimer enjoying, at one stage, was a 10-shot lead before Ooh. being reeled in by Frenchman Gary Stahl. We've seen a history of unexpected winners at this championship. Gary Stahl, Robert Rock back in 2012, when he beat Tiger Woods, J uh, Pablo Larrazabal defeating Rory and, and Phil Mickelson just a couple of years ago. Why is it that this championship, Danny, throws up so many unexpected surprises? Well, I think first of all, it's the start of the year. So a lot of the, the, the guys who are starting out their European careers, they're hungry, they're training hard, they want to get off to the, you know, the season with a bang. Um, number two, they're that good. I mean, it's, it's very diverse field. These players are so good that anyone can win. Uh, and lastly, they're not scared to win. You know, they, they seize the opportunity and they just take it. So great to see. Martin Keimer coming off the back of that disappointment last year, Callum. Where do you see Martin going from here? Obviously, he loves the golf course. He's won three times before, but he'll be wanting to block out all those distractions, all those bad memories, really, of what happened 12 months ago, won't he? Yeah, he will. I think, uh, I think he'll do that. He'll focus on the, the positives around this golf course. He's won three times. He will, mentally, he will be over that for sure. He'll be ready to, you know, to play this golf course. OK, good stuff. Well, not just the players and not just the fantastic array of stars here in action this week, but there's also so much going on off the golf course as well. Abu Dhabi Sports Council presiding over the event with HSBC's involvement. The interactive village is something else to behold. It's probably one of the best in the world at providing off-course entertainment for all the family. Danny, just give us a flavour of what fans and spectators can expect when they come down to the championship this week, or away from the golf course. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I, this is my seventh championship now, and, and every year it continues to get better and better and better. So. The interactive village has got more for the kids and more for the family and golfers to do. Um, and you know, the Troon team here have, have also provided some great entertainment of an evening at our, at our sky bar and in the clubhouse, and not to mention night golf as well. So uh, for people who are keen to be around golf, this is the week to do it. OK, fantastic. Well, guys, thank you so much for joining us and lending us your insight. We wish you all the best for a, what should be a, a fantastic week here at Abu Dhabi Golf Club. Get down yourself to the championship. There's so much to do both on and off the course. The, the stars of the game are here, three of the world's top five. It's Jordan versus Rory and a whole glittering cast of golfing stars in attendance as well. So get down and Golf Digest Middle East looks forward to bringing you all the updates live across the week.